everyone welcome back to my channel today I am going to be sharing with you my top uh, five essential oils for sleep support if you're new here my name is Renee I am so glad that you are here please go ahead and subscribe if you have not already and we're gonna jump into this so if you don't know anything about essential oils um, I'm not gonna give you a whole spiel right now um, just a quick little overview. Essential oils are extracted from plants, herbs, flowers, citrus fruits, stuff like that. And um, they can be used in many, many different ways. I personally only use Young Living essential oils because of their seed to seal promise, um, which you can read more about at seedtoseal.com. I'm not going to go into it. That's the brand that um, I choose and I love and I trust because I know that it is 100% pure essential oils that the dirt that they're using is pure the seeds the way they extract the way that they bottle everything is pure and there are no toxic chemicals or anything like that at all in these products um, specifically today we're gonna I'm gonna be sharing with you my top five for sleep support um, these are the oils that are always next to my bed without fail you'll always find them there I love to diffuse these oils at night and I'll let you know which kind of combinations I like to do but I'm gonna just start out with some that come in a premium starter kit which is how everyone gets started with Young Living and essential oils um, it basically comes with 11, actually now it's 12, essential oils, a free diffuser, and a bunch of other samples. It's amazing. Um, I will leave a link down below in the description bar if you are interested in signing up and getting your starter kit. But again, I'm not going to go into the whole spiel. We're just going to talk about essential oils that I like to use for sleep support. Um, I'm assuming if you're watching this, you're already pretty familiar with essential oils. Maybe you're looking for some recommendations. Um, Several of these oils I'm talking about are exclusive to Young Living because they're Young Living blends that they created. So you can only get them through Young Living. Um, so if you're interested, leave a comment or send me a message and I will contact you and let you know how you can grab some of those. But the first one is Stress Away. I'm not going to try to zoom in. It is what it is. Um, this smells like vacation in a bottle is what everyone says it's pretty citrusy but also has like a warm vanilla scent to it so this has um lime and cedar wood and lavender and vanilla it smells very good and it is very very good at just melting that stress away as it's named um so I love to diffuse this one by itself or mixed with others. I diffuse it during the day, I diffuse it at night. I diffuse this one all the time at work um, at my desk just because things can get stressful and this just kind of helps to just <sighs> make you feel a little bit more relaxed. So um, I'll let you know kind of what combinations I like to do, but this guy is good by himself and he's also good mixed with others. And that does come in a premium starter kit. Another classic one is lavender. Everyone's pretty familiar with lavender, so I don't have to really explain. It's, it smells like lavender. It's very calming, very soothing, relaxing. I diffuse this one on its own at night, and I also like to diffuse it mixed with other things at night as well. Um, this, this has many, many great uses, so I encourage you to just look it up, um, lavender essential oil, and find out the uses of it but I love it. Um, that one comes in the starter kit and frankincense also comes in the starter kit and I absolutely adore this oil. This is my second bottle of frankincense and I'm more than halfway done, which makes me sad. It's a little bit more of an expensive oil, but it's definitely worth it. I use it very sparingly. I use like one drop at a time. Um, it's just frankincense, pure essential oil comes in the starter kit as well and I I will diffuse this one on its own I diffuse this one a lot when I do yoga um, but I also like it at night when I sleep it just creates a very grounding and calming aroma the last three that I just talked about lavender stress away frankincense actually smell really good together I'll do like two drops of lavender stress away and a drop of frankincense and it smells 
so good and I sleep so good with it. Um, it really, really calms the mind after a long day. Hi, Piper. <laughs> My little pup. Another classic oil for sleep is cedar wood. This one, mine kind of spilled and it's a little sticky. This one smells like wood, <laughs> hence its name, cedar wood. Um, this one's really, really good for sleep support. I've heard a lot of people say that they sleep 10 times better when they diffuse this one. If you don't know, essential oils are actually so powerful that they can cross the blood brain barrier of the limbic system, which allows us to inhale them and actually see benefit or like feel benefits in our brain. Um, hence, making them really good for relaxing and calming. Um, so cedar wood, I don't love the smell on its own, but I do mix with lavender a lot. So cedar wood and lavender is a go-to for me. Um, I do these two together probably once or twice a week. I, I don't usually do the same oils every single night because I heard that you can kind of get accustomed to them and they can lose Kind of like their benefits so i try to switch it up every night but this is a go-to i do this one quite frequently lavender and cedar wood and then my final oil recommendation for sleep um are peace and calming one and two now these are exclusive to young living these are blends that young living created um my peace and calming one is actually empty i have another one coming in my wellness box next month but um this one has tangerine, orange, lang, -lang patchouli, and blue tansy, and Peace and Calming 2. Now they make a second version of oils. From what I understand, they make a second version when the first version is sold out for an extended period of time because a certain oil is not available. So they make a second version with a little bit variation in oils, but still giving you the same benefits and a relatively similar smell. So this one also has tangerine, ylang ylang, orange, patchouli, and it has northern light black spruce instead of what this one had was blue tansy. So they're pretty similar in smell, which is why you can use either one or two. I personally love them both. Um, I find that Peace and Calming 2 is a little bit of a sweeter smell, in my opinion. I think it smells really good. They both smell really good. Um, I will diffuse these. I'll actually diffuse one and two together. I'll diffuse one on its own or two on its own. Or I will mix it in with Stress Away. My favorite, 100%, hands down, Favorite oil combination for sleep support is Peace and Calming, either one, with Stress Away. It smells so good and I sleep like a rock. Like I sleep so good, personally, when I diffuse these two and they, it's my, my favorite go-to, especially when I'm feeling very overwhelmed, maybe about the next day, maybe something's coming up the next day that I'm feeling overwhelmed about, I tend to not sleep very well. And so I diffuse peace and calming and stress away together when I go to sleep and really helps to just calm the mind and allow me to sleep and not stress so much about what's gonna happen the next day. So those are my top, I guess it's technically six oils, but I count peace and calming one and two as one because they're interchangeable. Um, those are my top oils for sleep support. If you have a favorite oil for sleep support, leave it in the comments below. I would love to hear it. I do have a few others that I use here and there, but these are my favorites. Um, but I would love to hear your favorites and why you love them. And if you are interested in getting some of these essential oils, you can click the link below to go ahead and order your starter kit and join my team and I'll send you some gifts. Or you can just message me if you have further questions um, on my Instagram, which will also be linked down below. And I would love to chat with you. But yeah, these are my favorites. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, go ahead and like this video and subscribe so that you can see more videos like this. And I think that's all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.